Hey guys, welcome back to another Thomas Wooden Railway discussion. I'm so excited to show everybody this. This is my brand new in the box Ada, Jane, and Mabel. Um, this is a very difficult item to come by. Just, just to get all three of these together individually used is very difficult. I happened to find this on eBay a few weeks ago for a pretty decent price of $76, and that was brand new in the box. I ended up buying it. <clears throat> it turns out that it was the, the first year of release, which made me really excited, 1999. Uh, it says clickety-clack on the front of the box right there, as you can see. Uh, these a little bit of history on these. These were the first coaches uh, made of basically majority of it was plastic rather than wood. Um, so that's kind of interesting to know, um, which is not ne something I necessarily like. But for these models, they were just very interesting. You know, I think the base is the only part that's wood on here. You can see the black on the bottom. <laughs> that's the only part. The actual coaches are all plastic. Um, Ada, Jane, and Mabel are definitely considered very uh, rare. There weren't that many of them. It was, it came out in two, or it came out in 1999 was the first year, or they, uh, and I believe it was discontinued like the next year or so, 1990, actually 2000, I believe, 2001 or so. It was only out for a few years. Uh, I know, um, but the first year in the catalog was like 99. Um, <clears throat> they're one of the few uh, characters um, in the Railway series. Um, I believe there was D199, Coldy, Catherine, Frank, Mike, Wilbert, uh, Rickety, Neil, the Sodor Railway Repair, which is another item I'd like to uh, discuss later, um, uh, Fred Pelhay and uh, Ivo Hugh. Uh, Ada, Jane, and Mabel, as you saw, they came in a three-pack, so I don't think too many people ended up buying this because they were pretty pricey back then. I'm not sure what the retail, but I'm guessing they were probably around 40 bucks, which was pretty expensive for the uh, average family back in the day to own those. Um, on the back, and I'll get to the back uh, in a minute, their names are actually written in cursive. Uh, these are the only open air, as you can see there's no top to them, the only open air co um, passenger coaches in the Wooden Railway uh, series. Um, let me th let me flip it around to the back here for you. Okay, there's the brown label at the top says Add a Jane and Mabel, and then you can see it says clickety-clack. Uh, made from real wood on the bottom right says from ages 2 to 102. I'm going to go ahead and flip here. Uh, you can see all across the side, everywhere it says Ada Jane Mabel all over the place. I think on the bottom it says the same thing. Let's go ahead and flip the back over so you guys can see that. Uh, I like to show this because a lot of people haven't seen the, the box. Uh, it's got a little history at the top it says about on the island of Sodor. Da 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 da. Kind of tells you a little bit about them. Um, right there there's a little bit I'll zoom in so you guys can read that see if my camera will focus here um, it talks about all three of them um, I'm not sure if there's a character card in here or not I kind of peeked in the box but didn't open it up and there was uh, everything's in you know wrapped individually so it's kind of cool there's plastic around everything it's never been used um, let me show you a little bit down here let's see if I can get this hold on a second here sorry guys for the blurry camera here and the lighting actually I think 98 was the first year. Let me see if I can zoom in. Yeah, because these are dated 97, the box, which is the first year. But um, the first year that a lot of people would go off of, and sorry, you probably can't read that. It's kind of blurry, is the uh, the catalog date. And I think these were issued as new in the 1998 catalog. So that's how a lot of the collectors would say. Even though the box is dated 97, um, the actual trains were released in the fiscal year of 98. So that's kind of how that works. Um let me know what you guys think about this item. Um, it's kind of an interesting and unique item to own. Um, I, I'm so happy that I was able to pick this up brand new in the box um, as a collector. And uh want to know what everybody else thinks about Adam, Abel, and James. It's kind of, uh, you know, why would you really want these, I guess, as a kid? I thought they were kind of cool as a kid. I never did own them, but, um, you know, I was one of the few, I think, that actually did want to own them. But... Um, they're not your normal trains, so and they're like I said, they're made out of plastic. But wanted to bring up the discussion, so if you guys could, uh, you know, leave a comment in the comment section as normal. Uh, please like this video and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Okay, I'll keep throwing these videos up for everybody to see this uh, collection that I have. Okay, thank you guys. Appreciate it. Talk to you later.